Hi guys, in today's video, I want to share what I got um, at the hospital. And as you can see, I gave birth to my beautiful daughter. And um, before that, I always research on YouTube to see like, because people was always saying, at the hospital, they provide you everything. You don't need to take anything, even clothes for yourself, for the baby, only like to go home and all of that. So I always wanted to know if that was true. And of course, it may vary from hospital to hospital, but I wanted to have an idea. And then I love the videos I watch it. So now I have my own. Uh, my hair is not even close to like being put together, but she completed a month old yesterday. And I just, I, I have to do this because this bag has been sitting in the corner of my house for a while. And uh, I just want to put things on its place. So I have to do this video already. And I have her here napping with me for, for a little bit. Um, so I'm gonna show what I got like from them and also what they um, provided during this day. Um, first I will show like this bag that when I got from the recovery area to the um, reco to the room, um, this was in the bathroom. Oh. And it had some stuff on it and in the bag i'm not sure if you could see but i'll try to put a video or a photo of it if you can really tell um it has the name of the hospital and says memories are born here and then there's like a zipper here on the front like a little pocket and then it's like a pretty nice decent size bag i would say and it had some stuff in it already um it had these meshy undies like the stuff that i had to use like during the stay um i got this left i ended up not using it but i actually brought a couple home i wore it here at home for like two three four days because it comes to in in a pack so they provided me this in the hospital and it was also in the bag these are the undies they were okay they're pretty um, see through and I only found, found that out when I got home because I was wearing here and I saw myself in the mirror because my outfit was pretty much my bra my um, nursing bra and this undie so that's how I realized it was pretty see-through something else that was inside were like this they actually a bunch left over um, so this is kind of like a pee pad I would say but it's not as big. It's like this. And um, they would say, put this, put the pad in here and this inside the undies. So it would make like a bigger surface area. So like no blood or anything would come through. It had the, the undies, this, and also the pads. They actually provided pads for me during the stay and also at the end, the nurse said, like, do you need any supplies? And I said, like, yeah, if she's offering and it's not already the leftover. And if she can give me anything, I said, yeah, sure. So the supplies she gave me was, like, this. And these were the pets they provided at the hospital. They're pretty big. They're actually called the bladder pets. And this also came in the bag. And also they provided during the stay. Because of course I would change it often with the blood and everything. Um, so they're big, and this she actually sent home with me. That's why I have this here, and also the leftover I had from the bag I still used here, and I still use it sometimes. Um, something else that came in the bag was like the the socks. I already had some from the day of the operation and I didn't wear it after so this didn't even open but these are the socks it has grip on them on both sides and I mean they're not the most comfortable or um, cute but they do the job um, and I would say that's it that was in the bag oh also a, a toothbrush I think a toothpaste, maybe I used it, I don't know, but I brought my my size 
um, to the hospital anyway. So this was, was in the bag. But there's the stuff during the stay. One of the things I got was like the famous Perry bottle, of course. Because uh, they um, taught me how to use it. And like after they took off the, um, the tube that I was peeing into, I think. But it, whatever the name is called. So they showed me how to use this. Something else was this uh, belly binder. Is that what it's called? I think so. It's pretty big. I would say it would fit like most people and I was pretty big size so it fit me. Um, I wore it at the hospital and maybe one day at home I want to wear it but they say oh you can wear it sleeping so I'm basically always either nursing or sleeping so and when you're sitting it's not that comfortable um, but it did help me a lot at the beginning especially when I had to start walking it would kind of like give a little pressure so it helped a lot and they provided this um and i started to feel oh, pain like in my nipples um they gave me the lenolin and it was like this tiny too but i said they actually sell it like on amazon and stuff they sell like three for ten or something so pretty expensive i'd say and I got three because one was running out. I asked more. She brought two. The lactation consultant also gave me something for my uh, breastfeeding journey. And it was this standard care hydrogel. They are like kind of silicone pads. They're pretty nice actually. Um, I still use them but they're almost out of their life. Um, you run through cold water for like a couple seconds or a minute or something. Here it says one to two seconds and then shake off excess water set aside for two minutes i never waited two minutes i put it right away but I like you wait and then you put it on your breast but it doesn't like i don't know if it's because i never wait but it doesn't stick to it it, it just like sits nicely so i always had to wear a bra otherwise it would fall I'm not sure if if you wait two minutes if maybe you don't need to wear something um so yeah and that's and that's from the medela something else that i got kind of like breastfeeding related um was a manual pump because one day um baby didn't want to eat for my breast and then like she was crying we got like nervous and she was kind of like refusing it so the nurse brought me like a manual pump i'll try to insert a picture here and like it was a complete manual pump from medela as well um the one that could do this yeah um so some stuff uh that was in the bathroom or like a little lotion and shampoo then something else i also needed for pain that they gave me was like this instant hot pack she gave me like two extra just in case they needed because I had the pain and that was it and for Lillian she she got like this of course that was in her like little um, crib all the time with her we never used it but I believe they used and we never used home but I wanted to bring it anyway just for memories uh, they put the this washing shampoo also this little tub here that i used here when we came home um and also just one for memories for now the wipes that were in her crib like it was this brand we brought the leftover now it's just a little bit but it was a ton. Also, like the wipes and the diapers. Um, they had huggies. And then they actually sent home a pack. I brought the pack that was left over to. And they sent home us with a one, but she, she's doing the newborn. She gave me on this bag. 
she also asked if I wanted formula. I said, yeah, why not? And we ended up using it. And she said, which one? And they said, Enfamil, the Gentle Ease. And also at the end, uh, the last day, my milk started to come. So my bra was like soaking. And then I, she had any breast uh, nursing pads and she did. So she gave me this box. And here, how am I use like the reusable one that is like made of bamboo, cotton, whatever. So those are the things that I got from the hospital um, and like clothes for her they would provide. I, I mean, of course I had to stay there. Also like the gowns for me, I I never used anything like from home like clo clothes wise for me because I was like, I don't care. And for her as well, just to come home. Uh, so I thought it was really nice. I mean, it, it is included the price that is pretty pricey giving birth here in the u.s but i would say we got a nice share of stuff provided and i just i used everything i could i asked for everything i could because you know and all the stuff that's in there there's something that like you can reuse like only like clothes and the blankets and like the little hats that you can take but all, all the rest like you can take home so i brought like the leftover diapers the wipes the everything but i believe that's it if i remember something else i'll try to like insert here later but i think that's it that's what i got from the hospital um i hope you liked it because i definitely enjoyed watching other people so i hope mine is Nice to watch as well, um, and see you in my next video. Bye!